Okay, we're going to have a look uh, at an app uh, I learned with Poco, Emotions and Colors, and this is by Tribal Nova. To play Poco Stories, click on the little green chairs. To start painting, click on the table. So just like every other app that Travel Nova has out there, you can download these for free and play um, a certain part. And then if you like the app, you can just download the full version within the app. So you can download this for free and um, then, like I said, buy the full version if you like it. You can add um, a certain amount, number of people. We've got a profile for Benjamin up here and you can see the progress that he's made. And it's very easy. Just click on there to add a child. And you get to choose a nice picture from some that they provide you. If you click on check progress, it brings you to a screen that has the person you're checking on here and shows you how far they've gone in each level. If you click on more detail, it'll tell you how many they've got right and how many they got wrong within each one of the levels that they tried also. They have a number of other apps that concentrate on things like math and literacy and language. Um, and it does the same for all of those. So if you pull those, if you register and you pull those up, it'll give you the uh, data tracking and everything. Um, go back into the kids zone, let's have a look at the app. So we've got two parts to this, emotions and colors, and each part has three levels. I'm just gonna show you very quickly a couple of them. So let's click on emotions. Choose a level. And you get to choose between uh, level one, two, and three, obviously. We'll just choose one in the middle here to show you how this now works. Now you have new feelings to find. Watch and listen to the video. Click each face to hear what feeling it shows. Then choose the face that shows how the character in the story is feeling. Click on the play button to hear a story again. If you need a hint, click on Mr. Murphy. Poco was driving when Bibi suddenly shouted, Stop! How does Poco feel? Okay, so the idea is obviously to listen to the story and then decide which one of the expressions on the top of the emotions that he would have. Now to go through them. Loving. Proud. Surprised. And you choose the appropriate one. So we'll click Surpri some. Surprised. Get That's right. Small reward. Minus erased the wheel. Now Poco can't play his baby game. How does Poco feel? And the same thing. Happy, frustrated, proud. So as you go through the different levels, obviously with level one, there are less choices of emotion and level three, there are more choices to choose from. So you get to advance as you uh, learn the certain emotions. Um, frustrated. If you press the That's arrow down it. here, you can hear the story over again if you need to. More stories. I'll just show Poco you one more here. All the way to the top of the mountain. How does Poco feel? Frustrated. Sad. Proud. And let's make a wrong answer. Frustrated. And it'll pop back up. So. Proud. Great! Poco the hockey star shoots! Uh-oh! Is minus okay? How does Poco feel? Worried. That's right! Let's do other stories. Poco tripped. And so on. So it continues to go through. Um, like I said, you get more emotions depending on the level. And if you look Poco in the data stories, collection, click on the little green chip. Like we did earlier, you'll see that the level two is now showing up there on the emotions. And you can see how much uh, we went through on there. So let's go back to the app and Start have a look painting. at the colors. Click on the table. What you'll also notice in the bottom right, you've got a spaceship. If you click on this, What it does, it opens up all of the other apps, but also shows you the Dad, rewards you've oh, got within the app. 
touch my planet to play with them. So, so far we've got these two gifts, uh, rewards down here, and this will fill up as you go through. This is emotions and this is colors. And then you have all of their other apps that are free. And you can play with these rewards within those apps. So I'll let you explore that, but it is a lot of fun and a good way to get into the other apps. So let's go ahead and have a look at colors. Now, this is very neat because what it does, it lets you mix colors to make colors. To start painting, click on the table. Choose a level. And again, you've got three different levels from obviously easy to more complex. We're going to start, we're going to show you the level three on this one. Copy his new pictures. He's added even more shades of colors. So how this works. add white paint to make a color lighter. You can click on up to four paint buckets to make a new color. To clean your colors, click on the water cup. When you think your picture and Poco's picture are the same, click on the sketchbook. If you need a hint, click on Mr. Murphy. So pretty straightforward. How this works is if you select a color, it'll pop up here. And if you select another one, you'll see these are now big. It'll make that color and you can take any color out at any time that you like. Um, and you can see the color it makes when you mix these two. So the idea is to recreate this picture in the bottom and make it up here. So let's do the elephant first. We need pink. So we add red. We make it lighter with the white and we have the pink. So now we have this, we can press the elephant. We want to clear that. We just press the water and all the colors are gone. So let's see if we can complete this picture. And if you think the picture matches what you have here, then you simply press the book. Nice picture. Let's continue. And you complete it. And you carry on and you go through the levels with different pictures. And we're on level three, so it's a little more complex because it has four different colors down the bottom. But it really is great. And uh, it's a little bit of a challenge. Certainly when Benjamin's tried this, um, he's not really into uh, learning about mixing the colors quite yet. Um, but he had a lot of fun playing with what colors he could make by clicking on the different pots. So head back out. Um, I hope you get a chance to take a look at this. Like I said, it's free for you to try. To play Poco Stories, click on the little green chairs. To start painting, click on the table. And uh, have a look. Emotions and colors. I learn with Poco and uh, it's a lot of fun.